You're watching Greater Brockton, Mark Lindy, your host, and today I have a community activist here in the studio. But it's 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 a little off of a community activity. It's it's a for it's a sorority activity, <laughs> but it's for the community, yes. right? So Gwen Knowles, welcome. Nice to see you. You as well. Thank you. Uh, it's hard. You you're busy all year long. You know, over at Southeastern Regional, helping our students over there, and it's school vacation week. Mm -hmm. And but you have a great event coming up in May that you're involved in. You're a proud sorority member. Let me see if I get this straight. Delta Sigma Theta. Yes. Okay. Good. Good. I'm lousy at the Greek alphabet, so I don't know anything <laughs> about that. But you're doing a Mother's Day brunch. Yes. Tell us about it. Sure. Um, so it's our, our second annual Mother's Day brunch. Um, it's going to be on Saturday, May 13th mm -hmm. at Lantana's from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. Um, last year, we had the was fortunate enough to have a city council at large, Shana Barnes, who is also a member of the sorority, be our MC. And this year, she's agreed to be the MC again. Uh, she was wonderful last year. Uh, we have live music. We have raffles. Um, everyone has a chance to be dressed up. People wear hats if they if they like. It's just a really nice time to be able to honor your mom or our mother figure. Well, I know Shana has the hats because uh, <laughs> usually you see her. The hats, the matching accessories, <laughs> and the shoes, all three in the same place. And and I would bet you she's a good MC. Oh, I, yes. I've seen her actually perform Yes. over at the Orpheum in Foxborough. Um, but uh, Shane is pretty versatile when it comes to all of that. Um, yes. So how... Is this a whole area for the sorority? What, what, what's your, what's your, you know, uh, I, I guess geographical bounds, if there are any? Sure. So um, we cover counties um, from from Barnstable County all the way up to Plymouth County mm -hmm. um, and the sorority, uh, we do service in those particular areas. Um, sisterhood scholarship and service is the cornerstone of the sorority and that's something that's very important uh, to us. So this um, brunch is for the community and also there's a, a added feature that we've added this year called the phenomenal mom award mm -hmm. where we're really looking for someone from the community to nominate their mom um, and on our website which I will give that information we have um, the application as well as the criteria to be able to nominate their mom so that we can recognize that person in regards to being a phenomenal mom. Oh, wow. Well, we all know that moms rule the world. <laughs> uh, at least you're not supposed to talk back to them, that's for sure. And you have a phenomenal mom. So, oh, thank um, you. You know, I, I would think she would be a, a great candidate as well. Um, well, it's really for the community. We're trying to see if, if sorority members um, didn't, because that would look kind of... True. Yeah, true. Gotcha. you know, you invite someone for your home for dinner and you eat up all the food. Oh, okay, I like that. I like that analogy. Um, but, you know... Interestingly, usually, you know, fraternal and, and sorority events are usually for members of those groups. This is nice that you open it up to the community. How, how big is the, the group as it is that you're in it? I know Shane is in it, probably other people I know. Yeah, oh yeah, definitely. Um, yeah, we have um, over uh, 40 members. Mm -hmm. um, e even more if you count active as far as inactive, but um, the sorority is, is one of those um, type of activities, just like a mason, that when you're in it, you're in it for life. So whether mm -hmm. you're, if you're active or inactive, you're still um, a part of the sorority. So um, this is really special to you. I know you've talked about the sorority before. I hear Shana talking about it all the time. <laughs> Tell people why they need to go to this. And, and that's the other question. Can, can people that come to it from the community, how does, the, we're going to do another uh, segment on mm -hmm. the sorority itself, but just I'm just curious right now. Do people get asked to be in the sorority? Uh, how, how does well? It's that a all it's work? a process. Um, if people go to our website, which again that information will be given, um, they can find out in regards to details about um, being a part of the sorority or um, for males of fraternity as well. Okay, that's very cool. So you mentioned different things that are going to go on. Live music. What? Type is it? A, is it jazz? Yes, yes, because it is. It's a Mother's Day jazz brunch. Okay. Um, we have a performer by the name of Paul White that is going to be um, the entertainment. Okay. And so the tickets, yeah. uh, tickets are sixty dollars, mm -hmm. and they're thirty-five for seniors and for children. And seniors beginning at age sixty-two, 
and for children um, beginning at age 13 and up. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's, that's good to know. So you don't want the mothers to leave the children at home. You want them to bring <laughs> no, them. No, definitely. It's a, it's a family-friendly it event. And also, um, we're encouraging people to go online. So when I uh, give the information about the website, to go online um, for brown paper tickets to be able to purchase the tickets because uh, tickets will not be purchased at the door on that day. Okay. So, so online you got a plan. is... You got a plan. Yes. Okay. Yes. So do you have the online address? We'll put it up on the screen. Sure. Go ahead. It, definitely. So it's www.dst npcaac.com. Again, that's www.dstnpcaac.com. And the NPCAAC stands for the chapter that I'm involved with. It's the Norfolk Plymouth Area County Alumni Chapter. There you go. I was going to ask you what that was for. <laughs> now, uh, there are people that don't necessarily do do web-based. Is there any kind of a phone number? Can they get yes. tickets through yes. some of the sorority sisters? Definitely. So okay. I will give the phone number as well. It's 617-304-6275. And arrangements can be made in regards to if there is going to be um, cash uh, to be able to buy tickets. Okay, but but not at the door. We, not we at the door. Get, you yeah. want to count. What's the capacity? Do you know the capacity? Well, it's going to be at Lantana's, yeah. as I said. So at least 200 people okay. in the room that we're, that we're having. Um, and also, we're, we're having the brunch um, as a fundraiser as well because we give out a scholarship each year. It's the Eleanor Morton Scholarship mm -hmm. that we give out to a senior from a high school, either in the areas that we service, if they live in that area, or if they attend a high school in that area. And as a matter of fact, a, a young lady last year from Southeastern Regional did get the the scholarship last year. So that that scholarship recipient, as well as um, one individual from their family, will be able to attend the brunch for free. Oh, that's nice. So you mentioned. Plymouth County, which we're in, mm -hmm. Norfolk County, yes. correct? And I think I heard Dukes, you mention Barnstable. Barnstable, and, Nantucket, okay. yes. Um, we, we, we cover so, a lot of service areas. So south, pretty much like southeastern Massachusetts yes, the and southeastern. the islands, which, yes. is, which is good. Come up on to Brockton. It's not, it's not summer yet when everybody's <laughs> going the other way. Get them to come here. Um, final thoughts? They gave me the minute cue. Tell us, uh, you know, if you want to tell the viewers exactly Sure. Um, please come out to support the event, um, not only just for the scholarship, but also you're going to have a wonderful time. Um, the entertainment is going to be great. Shana is great. And just being able to come with your family, but also meet new friends as well. Perfect, Gwen. So Mother's Day brunch, uh, Saturday, May 13th, Delta Sigma Theta sorority over at Lantana. All the ticket information is there for you to Plan ahead and make it a great Mother's Day. You're watching Greater Brockton. Mark Linda, your host. Stay tuned for more events, places, people, and faces right here in the City of Champions.